Hello, my little elflet. <laughs> I hope you're doing well. Um, today I'm going to be doing a quick tutorial on how to do winged out eyeliner using the new Elf Cream eyeliners. Now this is brilliant. I really, really am enjoying this product. Um, you might be able to see that I have used absolutely tons of it because um, I love it that much. Sometimes I'm a little bit of a skank and will go to bed with my eye makeup on and this has lasted throughout a whole night and me sleeping in it and in the morning I've still seen the, um, the winged out eyeliner on my eyes. So that kind of shows you how much staying power it has. I really, really like it. So um, I like to apply my cream eyeliner with a stiff angled brush. Um, other people will like to use a really fine pointed um, blah, 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 like a paintbrush or a pointed liner brush, you know, one of those thin tip ones. But I like an angled brush because I feel like I can get a really nice shape using it. So I've got my cream eyeliner. I think they do it in a lot of different colours as well. I know they do a, a, um, a brown eyeliner, which a lot of people on the Facebook fan page call melted chocolate in a pot. So if you're one of them, hey! Um, and if you are not a member of that Facebook, fan page then you should definitely go on it because it's cool we'll have a lot of fun on it so I take a little bit of my product on there and I always start my eyeliner from the middle of the eye now I don't wing it out too much a lot of people prefer you know big old big old wings Um, I just like something subtle that I can wear for the daytime and it doesn't look like I'm making too much of an effort or look too tranny like so I start from the middle of the eye try not to pull your eye um, outwards. This isn't just because, you know, fine lines, etc. It's also because if you pull it out, you're basically extending your skin. So you'll feel like you are drawing a really long line and flicking it quite far out. But when you ping your eye back, it's actually going to really shorten that line um, and you're going to realise that you haven't done it long enough and then you're going to have to take it all off again. It's really annoying. So, using my brush, I literally just just lift this part of my brow bone up and shut my eye. Then from the middle of my eye, I go all the way out to the outer corner of my lash. And I stop there. I don't wing it out yet because I know I'll get over enthusiastic and it will all go terribly wrong. So, I then take a little bit more product and I just line the inner corner and bring it to meet the middle of my eye where I've initially drawn that line and I just thicken it out. So obviously you can leave it there if you want to. I'm going to start filling in my wing and crossing my fingers that it's all going to go okay. So I'm going to show you using the bottom of my pen. As you can see everybody's eye shape is different but my base of the bottom of my eye, my bottom eyelid, goes round the curve and then stops. I'm going to extend the line of my bottom eyelid. Okay, so I'm just going to follow the natural shape of it and where it stops, I'm just going to carry it on with my brush and my eyeliner. Everybody's got different shapes. Some of your eyes might be, you know, a bit flatter, not so curved, and then you'll curve it out there, etc. Et 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 so basically, just follow your eye shape and extend your line of your lower lash. Okay, so I'm going to pretend I've got a line here and I'm just going to place a line here as you can see. So I've extended my lash line up. Okay, next I'm just going to connect that point here down to meet my eyeliner. and smooth it out and you should see I've got a really really nice subtle wing okay obviously I've applied a primer before I have actually used where is it um elf mineral eyeshadow primer if you find you've got oily lids I would really really recommend um maybe setting this eyeliner and colour matching it to a powder and then setting it over the top is just a really really simple wing um for your eyes obviously if you want to extend it more then you create your line a little bit bigger so you can extend it like so 
and then you just make this part a little bit thicker like so and that will give you a more winged out effect and then if you want to connect the dots you can just any leftover product just tap it on your bottom lash line and that will just really help give some more definition and shape to your face so there is our quick little winged out um, eyeliner tutorial using the elf cream shadow I'm just going to apply the other eye and then I'll get back to you to take it. Okay, so there we have it. That is our beautiful winged out eyeliner using Elf Cream Eyeliner in black. Um, obviously, this look is going to take a little while to master. Don't expect to be fantastic at it, first of all. I wasn't. I remember sitting in front of a mirror with my makeup remover and just scrubbing my face every time I got it wrong. Um, but keep practicing, and I'd love to know how it goes for you. So, yeah, write a comment down below. Thanks very much for watching and I'll see you really soon for my next video. Bye.